After almost a year of traveling, I was finally in my last month in Japan, spending it in Tokyo, and what better thing to do first than make a house a home? I'm in my last accommodation in Tokyo now, and I'm walking to Don Quixote, so it's just there. And the walk through these lovely lanterns and the busy tradi the traditional street into the busy street. Such a lovely, probably the best walk to Don Quixote I've ever had of any of my stories. So I'm finally had some karaoke. Got my melon soda. This was up to 26 seconds, by the way. It's not a game. Well, I came out today to buy eggs. Had these eggs at a really good price. and just didn't stop walking and walked like 15 miles or something silly. Across three prefectures. I came out to the relative outskirts of Tokyo for a firefly festival, wandered around, enjoyed the atmosphere about 20 minutes and I found where it was and there was a queue of about half an hour to then queue as you're going walking on the river to maybe see some. So I decided that's not worth it but I have enjoyed just seeing a new part of Tokyo anyway. And look at this cool tree. <laughs> now three weeks until I leave Japan and when I visit somewhere it now genuinely feels like this is the last time I may be coming here. Tokyo Station. Might be the last time I see that for however many years until I return. Feels weird. It all feels weird. Reality crashes down soon. But it's nice to be able to visit them again. Like three weeks is the more than the average person spends in Tokyo in their life I think. So I've still got a lot to enjoy. No new shirt. Thank <laughs> you. 
What's that? Like there? A lot of things I'm doing now are going to be the last time I do them for a while, such as coming to a diver. And it is the most misty day I've ever been here. <laughs> I can barely see the bridge, just vaguely. Okay, before this section, like, because I'm editing this, what did I do with my shaving routine here? I just gave up, apparently. Wow. The Disney store, a cascade of poor events. I saw there was a free gift thing, so I walked up and said, hey, can I have it? And they said a bunch of Japanese stuff. And it turned them out, like, they did this with their hands, and they put it on their head, and I like, copied them. It turns out all they said, they trying to give me a hint. They said, we're going to play Dragon Ball. Come on. I'm going to go pay for you. Yeah. Beat me. And then I touched another, I, I got an item, I just got out of the shop, had a look, put it back, and one or two behind it, just broke into pieces, it was glass. I had to find someone. Yo, this happened. So, great last time at the Disney store. One more last, last time we should be crossing. So I want to go to the Nintendo store, and the magic store here. That's why I need you to be here. Stitch Rider with a like, Japanese language interactive experience. Thank God they didn't pick on me, probably on purpose. But it was interesting. And yeah, it's just a little bit. One thing pretty cool here that there's an island in the middle that you need to get a boat out to, which I think is kind of fun. Obviously, I didn't know about that last time. Today is my last day in Tokyo, so I wanted to record a little bit to see what I do. What I've done so far is spent three hours figuring out how to post my stuff back to England and spending a lot of money to do so. But now I should be okay on my flight. What a concha. This is going to be an expensive day because it's my last day. I can't worry about budget on my last day in Japan. So let's see. So let's see where we go. First stop, home, so I can drop my bag off. Having relaxed and finished my boba for half an hour, I've now set off and I have a five hour walk planned across Tokyo. First, I'm going to Akihabara. There's a few last things I want to pick up, have a last look around, say goodbye, get some souvenirs. Next, we're off to Tokyo Station for a last look at the Pokemon Center and a Notori, because there might be a little, well, we'll see if they have it in stock. Then, I might get the train, might not, down to Toyosu, 
It's not going to be sunset yet, but that's one of my... The walk from Toyosu to Odaiba is one of my favourite walks. It's by the sea, there's lots of lovely paths, it's fantastic. So I'm going to do that again. From there, look around Odaiba a bit. I love the area. Walk across the Rainbow Bridge. Last time was very misty, so we're going to have a lovely walk across there. From there, Zojoji Temple. My second favourite temple in Japan. First is in Nagano. Second, because there was the Diana Deli performance here, so it's stuck in my head and it's got a wonderful view of Tokyo Tower. Then it should be pretty late by then. So I've not decided if I'll head back or if I'm gonna go to Shibuya one last time again. I don't know what time it is. Let's find out. All right, I have left Akiba a few thousand yen cheap. I would say my wallet is lighter, but it's all on the card. Just to pay off at some point. Um, next stop, Pokemon Center. That one, possible. Damage zero yen. It's not too bad, but there is a Pokemon at the airport. So that might take some more damage, but today I resist it. It's so beautiful as well as I was today. What a clear, lovely day. My box socket's broke today, which makes filming much harder because I can't really hold the phone at a good angle, so that's fun. Um, so I might be able to replace that just to pop up store on my way back if the other one's closed and I leave tomorrow. So I might just be done, but I did get an ice cream. That's ice cream for the long walk back along Rainbow Bridge. And one thing I love about a diver is well, normally you can't even notice Tokyo Town in the background. Once it gets dark, you can't notice anything else from the view. Bridge walked over and one set of messy hair. I don't know if that is going to be open, but we're going to find out. The temple is indeed closed at this time of night as I expected. Let's look at the lovely view of Tokyo Tower behind it. So, I'll accept that. See you next time. It's the morning of my leave, that means it's half an hour until I have to check out and that means I'll have all my suitcases with me so I can't go anywhere else so I'm a close enough walk to Sensei I thought I'm going to do one last quick walk and then that's Japan See you Sensei, see you Japan